In 1973, a group of stupid teenagers went on a road trip through Texas to see Leonard Skinnerd. They were never heard from again. Authorities are advising against driving through Texas and listening to Leonard Skinnerd, whatever that is. This concert's going to be the grooviest ever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As long as we eat soon. I'm starving. And get some tail, too, if you know what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh Squirrely. Oh, Squirrely. That's my name. Don't wear it out. Uh-oh. This van is about to become a footmobile. Wait. Did you forget to fuel up? Sorry, I always think E means enough. What do you think F stands for? Finished. Classic Leland. Check it. There's a gas joint up ahead, gang. Last chance gas. Huh. I wonder what that means. It means we did, bro. Are you sure they're open? Let's honk more to find out. Howdy, folks. You lost or seeking trouble? We just need some gas, sir. And food. And some hot chicks, if you got them. Ain't got no gas left. Poor chicks. Seriously, this is a gas station, right? Yep. Tank's been dry for two weeks. <laughs> Don't know what happened to the driver. Hungry, kids? Sure. I'm hungry enough to eat anything. How about some barbecue and chili? It's finger-licking good. You don't want that. Trust me, son. I've got plenty of food for you. Get you all nice and fat and succulent. Uh, no thanks. We will just keep on trucking. What? But, but you still need gas. Oh, well. <laughs> See you all again real soon. <laughs> that guy gave me the creeps. Yeah, he was, a uh, spooky. Oh, let's listen to the radio to forget about all that. <laughs> Gas prices reached an all-time high of 53 cents today, up from 39 cents, sparking panic and chaos all over the country, most likely leading the U.S. to alternative energy sources in the future. In other news, President Nixon resigned after the Watergate scandal, showing that not even the president is above the law. Okay, enough of that. Oh, look, a hitchhiker. We should totally pick him up. Pick me up. Pick me up. I, I won't harm you. <laughs> Much. <laughs> Or not. And what are we going to do now? Find a second last chance gas station? Don't worry, gang. We can coast on fumes and I'm sure we'll never see that guy again. Wait. What? Where the hell are we? I think we're in that guy's basement. Connie? Oh, thank God I found you. Now, I just need to find uh, the others. What's taking you so long, Leland? Shh. I'm, I'm trying to not make any noise. I don't think it really matters at this point. <laughs> Hang on, he's still tied up. And turn that off! Yeah, uh... Can, can you just come back later? D this may take a while. Your man Squirrely here. Be sure your ass likes and subscribes for more Texas Chainsaw parody. Peace. In technology, something called the barcode has been added to products at your local grocery store. They claim it's for making checkout faster, but many believe they are using it to track our buying habits. In entertainment, a film called The Texas Chainsaw Massacre was released showing the rapid decline in cinema standards. Lastly, in some good news, a new invention called the Rubik's Cube was created that can only be solved by smart people, or dumb people if you just move the stickers around. <laughs>